Hi, I'm Brian McMorrow, Mallory's dad. I've known her my entire life. Your entire life. I wasn't alive your entire oh, life. Oh, that's right. All right, we're going to do that again. All right. Okay, last try. Yeah. The day we took you home from the hospital, the nurse takes you to the car, they put you in the child seat, make sure it's secure, and it's like, bye-bye. And, you know, as a dad, it's an awesome responsibility to raise uh, children. Yeah, and that's me and Eileen and your great-grandfather. So he was a teamster. Your grandfather worked for the New York Telephone Company. He has a splicer for many, many years, uh, becoming a foreman before he retired. He loved you and uh, your brothers. So there's Mallory in, in front of the house that she grew up in. Oh, that was First day of not. school. Got good hair here. I like that hair. Oh. Our summers, I think six or seven in a row, were spent in South Bend, Indiana. Here's a pretty good picture of you and your brothers on the campus in Notre Dame. You're running so fast around the track, I couldn't keep you in focus. <laughs> so athletic. <laughs> Chatham Bar's in. I don't think we actually stayed there. That was really expensive. We stayed at um, a, a motor lodge that was kind of inland. The Chatham Bars is like a five-star hotel Take right on the ocean. So but, we, like yeah. <laughs> um, but that was us in front of the sign of the Chatham Bars Inn. And here we are at the Liberty Science Center. You didn't know any of these kids, but you were kind of leading them in. Let's all get together and make believe we're underwater here. I think I grabbed just about every kid that was within earshot and said, mm -hmm. come here, come here, come here, look yep. what we can do. And like, I don't know who this kid is. I don't know who any <laughs> no, of these don't, kids are. No, we don't, know who, we don't any, know who any of these kids are. They're not our family. <laughs> Things were more fun when you had a lot of people involved and you could learn together. This one, oh, man. I forgot about. Mallory's mock trial in June of 1996. You were one of the prosecuting attorney against Peter Pan for kidnapping, <laughs> <laughs> breaking and entering, and kidnapping. Oh, and this is me holding up a piece of evidence. It's Wendy's bear. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you talk now about project-based learning, and we were doing it back in 1993. Wow. With two women attorneys who took Peter down. <laughs> In almost all of the situations, we would be with other kids that were your age, and you had to make friends, uh, and you wanted to make friends. Uh, in fact, I think you really looked forward to the chance to get out and meet other people. So I'm not at all surprised that you feel very comfortable knocking on a door right now and saying, hi, I'm Mallory, and here's what I believe. Um, you've been doing that for a long time, as long as you were that big. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we used to end our family vacation days with some ice cream. What do you say? Let's do it. Ice cream. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. <laughs>